Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass here and welcome to Irori, a game about cooking delicious meat skewers while listening to the stories of travelers. Hi and welcome aboard the Afterlight Express train. We are very pleased to have you as our traveling chef within the Irori cabin. We hope that you find everything you need to create kushiyaki skewers for our passengers. Pork belly, salty and savory, a good source of energy. Mmm. Dragon figs, fruity and sweet. Gobfish, mild and buttery, caught fresh from the riverlands. Mmm. Bark meat, sweet and sticky, from the emerald forest. Shiitake mushrooms, umami and juicy. Don't forget to chop some of the bigger ingredients before placing them on the skewer. You can find the kitchen knife on the left. Wishing you a good first day in the job. Tonkoweed, the train conductor. Well, thank you, Tonkoweed. The instructions, so what am I doing here? So we have a knife. There's a tray. This is, I'm assuming, for garbage. Uh, I don't see my soul in there at the moment. Pretty place. I'm kind of admiring the scenery right now. I don't want to touch anything, initiate the game. Okay, I kind of want to look around here. Got some, got a skewer right there. Got some tasteful stuff. Look at these little trees. I'm digging this. I guess it's an aquarium, but it has fish that glow in it. Which like glowfish, which aren't technically a true species. It's a, a breeding mutation. Look at a little, look at a little tanuki down here. I like it. I'm digging it. So pick up. That is, we want to chop and drop. So we want to skewer. Put that back. Here's our ingredients. So let's get some pork belly. We're going to want to chop this up. Now how precise can I make this cuts? Or is it just, okay, it's just, oh, three cuts every time. But maybe I want some, uh, you know, I don't want just pork belly on there. No, we don't we can't chop the mushroom. And let's let's get one of you on here. Sure. So skewer this. Some pork belly. Some of that. And some Okay, so three items is the limit. Put it down. The cook. We'll get a never skewer. Let's get some mushrooms right here. Flip that. I'm not sure what the cooking speed is. Put you here. Put you there. Put a fish out. Flip that over so I don't overcook it. Let's do some chopping. Okay. Oh, it's done. So I guess it was shining. That it's just well, that's just done. Okay. Mushroom. Pork fat. Honey. Hi there, are you the chef of this establishment? Yes. My name is Elote. Elote Emini. A pleasure to meet your acquaintance. Now I'm trying to cook here. I smelled something really good while passing by and followed it to the stream. An adventurer has to follow their gut. And my gut is empty. Please, I need food. I'm very hungry. Last thing I ate was a day ago. Please feed me. I am but a wee child. You don't look like one. Please feed me. Some. Well, I got... This was meant for myself, but here. Go for it. How you like it? It's my first time on the train. I bet my baby brother would like it here. Too bad Ellen's sick in bed. He's been sick for a while. The court physicians are hopeless. The little fay told me I'd be able to find the cure in the Emerald Forest. I'm sure it's there. It has to be. Now that I've had some food, I feel my strength returning to me. I'd like something sweet now. Something sweet. Well. Well. That's not helpful. Well, figs are sweet. And the bark meat is sweet. So. Stab. Let's put a couple figs on there and call it a day. Cookie over here. Yeah, that's that's looking good. 
flip it. I don't know if there's a science to this. I'm assuming when it starts twitching, maybe like flip it over. So you'll only put some work in here. Right, a train conductor, of course. It's done. I guess. Looks kind of overcooked to me, but you know, here. I'll admit, the household has not been the same since my brother's birth. Mother and father don't adventure with me anymore, and I can't even wander the garden as nervous about myself now. But the thunderstorms and all. Oh yeah, those thunderstorms, oof. Maybe they're just preoccupied of hell. That's what I tell myself anyway. We're approaching Glen Meadow Station. Glen Meadow Station. Yeah, it's the same cuts every time. For passengers are journeying to the Emerald Forest, please light at the next stop. Oh, that's my stop. That was surprisingly fast. To be honest, I'm a little scared of the outside. It looks rainy and dark. Anyway, I'd like to make a barter. There are things I must prioritize now as an adventurer, such as food. As such, I've decided that I won't be needing my family ring anytime soon. Here, take it. In return, I would appreciate three of your best skewers for my lunchbox. I will trust that they will be equally nutritious and delicious. Can we skewer the ring? <laughs> Here you go, good chef. My empty lunchbox in need of your services. Quickly, I don't want to miss my stop. Hey, you wiped out my thing. Nutritious and delicious. Pork belly. And shiitake. Put that on there. Put that on there. Put some more pork belly. Oh, chef is burning. No, it isn't. Put that in there. Skewer that. There you go. Put this in here. Flip that. Don't want to overcook it. That one is just not cooking. Hmm. Now it's done. Some Trisha's food in here. Perfect. Wait, there isn't anything sweet in here. You didn't tell me to make anything sweet. You gotta be specific with me, buddy. I suppose you're right. Maybe it's time for me to grow up into the adventure I've always wanted to be. I will turn buff and swole, just you wait. Good. No room for sweet meats here. You know, I think I can become a good adventurer. Sure, there are things that won't always work out, but I can work with it. If anyone asks for a load of many, I wasn't here, all right. Perhaps we'll meet again. I had a way back home anyway. Ta. Oh, postcard? From deep within the Emerald Forest, I'm writing to announce that I am officially a full-fledged adventurer after searching for a few days with the help of some fellow adventuring acquaintances and a rather rough-skinned old-looking person. It was really old. I could see moss was starting to grow on them. I found the root. It was pretty easy for me. I have quite keen eyes. I was set to return home with it, but I think I'd be adventuring a bit more. I've always wanted to go see the glowstones of Ruman's Cavern. I heard their walls taste sweet if one gave a lick. Which is absolutely bizarre, but fairly intriguing and piqued my curiosity. I've sent a parcel of roots back to the manor. There were some that I couldn't cram into the box. You can have a bigger size, can you believe that? Thought you might fancy trying these out since you're a little strange like me. Elorte the Adventurer. P.S. The weather's been looking rather abysmal recently, hasn't it? Oh. Oh, good for you. Oh, man. Are these... Are these Mandragoras? Oh, 
I do with them that from away? To be continued. Yes, yeah, so this is technically a uh, a preview apparently of this game. So that's it for what is a, apparently the Irori preview, which is I think a very cute concept. I, I was a little upset. This is my personal taste of skewers anyway. That the one customer we did get in the preview like sweet stuff, and I'm all up here, you know, like I'm here all about that pork belly. I'm here about that fish. He, he's just here to complain that hey, I'm trying to improve his sense of taste here. So, would have preferred we had more of a more of a person who leaned towards the pork belly, less towards the uh, the honey. But you know, beggars beggars can't be choosers. But it's a it's a very it's a very comfortable concept. It, it makes me think of Valhalla, which was a bartending simulator. Very similar, though this one's a little more, at the moment, somewhat more three-dimensionally involved. I would hope for a full version to have some depth to these skewers. Maybe you unlock more ingredients because, you know, they send you more ingredients, you get more access to more things, they get a little more persnickety and, like, very specific about what they want. I see in some of the screenshots of the game that they actually had multiple people there, not just one sometimes. So maybe maybe the people like talk amongst themselves, maybe be a little tension, or be like a little chemistry going on, and you know, while you're doing this, we're just making skewers of meat. We eat in shiitake mushrooms and whatever else you prefer on your skewers. So very comfy concept. I like it. I think there's a lot of potential to it, so uh hope it hope it gets finished. Anyway, so thank you all for watching me play Aurori. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.